best five instant cameras. It's been said that good things come to those who wait, but there's something magical about watching a picture develop right before your eyes. No waiting needed. With an instant camera, you get the same instant gratification as Instagram, but with an actual photograph. Planning a party anytime soon? Having an instant camera to pass around gives you all the fun of a photo booth without having to cram into a tiny box. Welcome back to my review channel. We will go through the best 5 instant cameras hoping we can help you choose the right one for you. We aim to save you time and money, we do the researching, testing and comparing. So when you decide you need a camera, you can have here all the information to choose one for you. Just check the description below. Hit the show more button to see the complete list for all products with the best offers we found and don't forget to subscribe. We make this review together so if there is anything we're missing, please comment below and we will check it. These are the 5 best instant cameras we will compare today. Let us know if you already have a favorite. First on our list we have the Fuji Instax Mini 9. The Instax Mini 9 is for complete beginners or those happy to work with a basic instant film model. If all you want is a basic point and shoot model, the Mini 9 should be perfect for you. It's a great solution for weddings, parties or selfies when you're out and about with your friends. A single button is used to push out the 60mm lens from the body of the camera. Extending the lens also turns the camera on and powers up the built-in flash, making it easy to get the camera up and running in a second or two. The shutter button is on the grip of the camera, located directly below the viewfinder. Focus is fixed with a claimed range of 0.6 meters to infinity, which should be good enough for most arm length selfies. It comes in 5 colors too, including cobalt blue, ice blue, flamingo pink, lime green, and smoky white. The camera uses two AA batteries and you can usually take around 10 rolls of film before having to change them. Because the Mini 9 is the cheapest mini camera on the list, it is good for people who don't want to spend a lot or those who want to see how much they enjoy instant photography before upgrading to a more advanced mode. What's really interesting is the close-up lens attachment. A macro-ish feel for your instant camera, so to say. This little attachment allows you to get up to 35 centimeters away from a subject in order to capture it on film, allowing you to get a bit more creative with how you shoot with your Fujifilm Instax Mini 9. To sum up, the Mini 9 is by far the most affordable Instax camera, and the film it uses is also cheap. The auto exposure takes a lot of hassle out of composition and the addition of a selfie mirror allows you to check the framing of your shot before taking the picture. Finally, it comes with a close-up lens attachment, which makes shooting up to 35cm away possible. If all you want is a basic point and shoot model, the Mini 9 should be enough for your needs. It's a great solution for weddings, parties or selfies when you're out and about with friends because it takes 2 seconds to come to grips with its functionalities. Let's move to our second product, the Fujifilm Instax Mini 90 Neo Classic. If you're someone who's more well versed in your instant photography or wants more creative control over the images and doesn't mind spending a bit extra, then the Mini 90 Neo Classic is right for you. Most instant cameras are built to look like toys, with their whimsical shapes and bright, eye-catching exteriors. However, if you're looking for a camera that looks a bit more grown-up and sophisticated than other instant cameras on the market, the Fujifilm Instax Mini 90 Neo Classic is the best instant camera for you. It comes in a sleek and timeless design and in only two colors, black or brown. This sleek and stylish camera gives users more creative control with brightness options, a high performance flash, and six different modes to choose from. It has a tripod socket, a front facing selfie mirror, a retractable 60mm lens, brightness control, automatic exposure control. It also comes with a rechargeable battery and a battery charger, so you won't ever have to worry about repurchasing batteries. On the rear of the camera, you will find five buttons located directly below the two LCD displays. These are used to control exposure and shooting modes, as well as the timer. The most welcome button of all, however, is the dedicated flash button, which lets you turn off the flash. Like all other cameras in the Instax camera line, the Instax Mini 90 Neo Classic accepts all Instax Mini instant film variants. You can choose from color film, black and white monochrome film, or color film with multi-color frames. 
To sum up, this camera has more controls than previous Instax cameras, the dual shutter buttons are a nice touch and the modes are great as well as the aperture ring light control. So if you're looking for more of a polished and professional look when it comes to your instant camera, and if you want a device that'll really give you control over the subjects you're shooting, then take a look at the Mini 90 Neo Classic. Third on our list, we have the Fujifilm Instax Y300. If you are looking for an instant camera that can print photos closer to 3 by 5 inches, this is your choice. This camera utilizes the large format Instax Instant Film. The Instax Y300 can create images 2.4 by 3.9 inches in size on a 3.4 by 4 by 3 piece of film. It also features a retractable 95mm f14 lens with a two-range focus zone setting for capturing sharp imagery, as well as a 0.37x optical viewfinder with a target spot for composing images. In doing so, you end up with a photo that's more reminiscent of the original Polaroid instant film. Powered by 4 AA batteries rather than the usual two, the Fujifilm Instax Y300 is the big daddy of the Instax print camera range. Its practically medium format camera-like enables it to deliver large prints that more closely resemble standard print dimensions. Its chunkiness means it's not really practical for selfies, yet its plastic build is lighter than you'd imagine. A lever that encircles the shutter release button on its bridge camera style hand grip powers this one up and extends its 95mm lens. With prints emerging from the slit in the camera's top plate, the only thing small here oddly is the left of center viewfinder, which could have been larger. Though control is limited to adjusting brightness and flash, if you want instant prints closer to the dimensions of proper photographs, this is the best option for you. Built into the Instax Y300 is a flash with automatic power settings and a fill flash mode. This complements the auto exposure settings to produce well lit images. Exposure compensation is available from plus minus 2 to 3 EV via a light and darken control for adjusting the shots based on the situation. Also, there is an LCD screen that displays numbers of shots remaining, the exposure compensation, and flash mode. To sum up, if you are looking for larger photos with vibrant lively colors, this is your option. Before we go on, if you are enjoying this video, please subscribe to our channel and let us know if there's anything missing here. We appreciate the comments. Next on our list, we have the Leica Support. So here it comes, for all the Leica fans, this is the first instant camera for this iconic brand. Leica has always been known for its top quality products, and the Support instant camera is certainly no different. The Support not only shoots with the popular Instax film, it is also currently the cheapest Leica that you can buy by a far margin. Like all Leica cameras, the Support has the high-end look and feel highlighted by a sleek and stylish design that makes it relatively compact and travel-friendly. The Support offers the same high-end look and feel that we have come to expect from the high-end German company and which separates it from other instant film offerings. This model works with a selection of instant mini format film, including color and monochrome offerings from Leica that sport a natural warm white border. Also, it is equipped with a capable automatic Hector 60mm f12.7 lens equivalent to 34mm in full frame terms with a 3 zone manual focus selector that will give photographers more control over the image's final appearance. The Leica Support offers a compact body with clean, intuitive buttons for navigating settings. There is also a 0.37x optical viewfinder with target spot and macro parallax compensation for accurately composing your images. Multiple automatic shooting modes further the camera's ease of use and when set to macro, it can focus down to 11.8 inches. The Support has been optimized for available light photography as well with a mechanical shutter with speeds as long as an 8th second and a built-in flash with a later firing speed that results in a more natural look. Users looking for more control over their photos can use an exposure compensation setting which can be set to negative 0.7 or positive 0.7 EV and a self-timer with a 2 or 10 second delay can be set. The support can be set up on a tripod thanks to an integrated quarter inch to 20 thread on its base. Strap lugs make it easy to attach a strap and carry around all day. It uses a rechargeable Lion battery pack that should provide enough power for about a thousand shots before needing to be recharged. 
To sum up, this camera doesn't disappoint. The quality of the picture is amazing and the look and feel is Leica. No need to say more. Finally, we got to the last camera, the Mint Instaflex TL70 2.0. This camera is for those users who are a bit more advanced in their knowledge of photography and want an instant camera that allows them more creative control over their images. Mint Camera is a small company based in Hong Kong, made its name in the camera community by offering repair service for classic Polaroid instant cameras. The Mint Instaflex lets you adjust aperture settings from f5.6 to f22. Use a variety of timed shutter speeds from 1 to 1 over 500 seconds. Use bulb mode shooting for up to 10 seconds and allows for manual focus and exposure control. The Mint Instaflex TL70 2.0 is a retro-styled twin-lens reflex camera that uses the Instax mini format. One of the priciest instant cameras on the market, it also offers the most manual exposure control as well as true manual focus. It's beautiful to look at, but the TL70's plastic construction feels slightly underbuilt. Buttons are creaky and the leatherette seems like it will peel. It's lighter than it looks too, though it is still larger and heavier than most other Instax mini cameras. This updated version 2.0 offers a brighter viewfinder than version 1.0 and there's also a flip-out focus magnifier. The shutter button is located on the front, which takes getting used to. It's powered by AA batteries, which should provide juice for at least 5 packs of film, from our experience, approximately 50 shots. To sum up, this camera is worth every penny, and for those wanting a fully manual instant camera, the TL70 2.0 is the best option. This is all for the best 5 instant cameras. Hope you have enjoyed this video. Click show more in the video description. We have looked for the best offers and you have the links to all the products in this video. Please subscribe and check out our photography playlist for more reviews on cameras and latest gadgets. We are looking forward to your comments to improve our videos. If you have any products you'd like us to look into, just let us know. Our team of experts is always looking for new ideas. Thanks for watching and stay tuned!